All right, guys, welcome back. I uh, got a 2018 Absolute Football Blaster Box. Got this on the cheap. Figured I'd give it an open. See if we can get lucky. Perhaps get that Lamar gentleman. Maybe Josh Allen. We're really desperate. Perhaps a Baker Mayfield. <sighs> Maybe in a Josh Rosen. Sam Darnold, no thanks. Right, obviously the jersey, non-autographed jersey in that pack. So open these up. Only got this for 18 bucks. So yeah, don't even bother asking me where, because it was definitely a one-time kind of thing. Cars have gotten ridiculously expensive lately. I mean, the prices have gone on up accordingly as well, but I still think there's a bit of a lag in that regard. We got Bilal Powell, Marvin Jones Jr., Doug Baldwin had to retire from injury, Jalen Ramsey, not with the Jaguars anymore. We got a nice DJ Chark introductions. It's a nice little uh, rookie parallel right there. Got a Leonard Fournette. Devontae Freeman, and also an Adam Thailand card. Yeah, unfortunately with Reed, so I can't really expect too much. Um, of course, you you get the uh, the one mem or auto. I'd say about ninety percent of the time it's gonna be a mem. And just hope to get a couple good rookie cards. Like, that chart was actually a pretty good start. Not going to lie. Go with the next pack. We got a Julio Jones. Might be the beginning of the end for him, unfortunately. Tom Brady playing tonight against the Bears, actually. Last I checked, it was 13-7. Trod Taylor, who uh, just lost his job to the rookie. Really sucks to be him. Uh... I can't imagine that that uh, team trainer did that with any kind of a uh, cruel intention, but it was just an unfortunate accident. Got Austin Prohl. I don't know if that's related to Ricky Prohl. Are we covering round Odell Beckham Jr. insert. Uh, we got Aaron Rodgers, Cameron Wake, and a little Jordan Howard action to brighten your day. Yeah, apparently the uh, team trainer before week two, or was it three, maybe? Injected Tyrod Taylor for his sore ribs and unfortunately injured him to the extent that he missed a couple games. And Justin Herbert, to his credit, didn't miss a beat, took advantage of a situation, and Anthony Lynn just named him the starter moving forward earlier this evening. We got Drew Brees. Uh, Alan Hearns, who completely fell off. I believe he might have opted out for this year. Ben Roethlisberger. We got a Okorafor rookie. It's a good name for all you little children out there. Josh Gordon. That looks like some kind of parallel. Not numbered. Uh, we got another Cameron Wake. Another Jordan Howard. And a Teddy Bridgewater. I forgot he was on the Jets for a little bit. Then transition to the Saints to be Breeze's backup. Parlayed that. Mixed with an undefeated starting record. Into a pretty nice deal with the Panthers. And he actually, as that team started out pretty decent, 2-2. Two and two, I pretty much thought they were going to be the bottom feeders for that division, especially under a rookie head coach. But to this point, they have proved me wrong in that regard. We got DeAndre Hopkins no longer with the Texans, of course. Neither was their GM who traded him at the time. Shard Matthews, Philadelphia Rivers, Cam Newton got that COVID action. Tom Brady, Rob Gronkowski, one-two punch. Same one-two punch this year. I already moved a little bit down south to Tampa Bay. Vaughn Miller, wish him the best of luck. Hopefully he can bounce back a little strong next year. And that was just an unfortunate kid reporter card in the back there. I don't know if you saw that or not. Uh, we got four packs left. And this is pretty much par for the course. If you are getting a retail blaster box, I mean, it's just fun to open packs. 
harder and harder to get cheaper and cheaper hobby boxes now. So sometimes you just take what you got to get. Not a lot of uh, give and take with these, unfortunately. We got Marshawn Lattimore. Uh, Ezekiel Elliott, who has been the target of trade rumors lately. I don't know how I feel about that as an Eagles fan. I I don't know. We'll see. They have the worst defense in the league, so can't get much worse. Can't go much further down than that. We got Kareem Hunt, who of course now is with the Browns, starting for Nick Chubb. David Williams, the Broncos. I am not familiar with him. Running back from Arkansas. Uh, we got a Brett Favre, Revolutionaries. Matt Ryan, 0-4 record. It looks like their Super Bowl window is absolutely jammed tight right now. Dalvin Cook and A.J. Green, who has come back this year, has looked like he's missed about three years. I know that's about what he has missed. Sometimes guys come back, they don't miss a beat. A.J. Green was a surefire Hall of Famer. Trajectory all the way to the top, unfortunately. Looks like injuries have taken their toll. But he is staying healthy, knock on wood. Giving the rookie Burrow an added veteran target. Uh, we got Terrell Suggs. James White. Man, I feel really bad for this kid. Say a couple prayers for that guy if you if you if that's your kind of thing. Uh JJ, Super Bowl champ. Late game heroics, Matt Stafford. We got a Derek Carr. Josh Norman. And Ryan Tannehill, of course, now with the Titans, who seem to be single-handedly determined to shut down the NFL season this year. Um, I just saw that their game is probably going to be rescheduled to this coming Tuesday. But if it remains to be seen what's going to happen if more players test positive, because, of course, they already had to have their bye week last week in week four. And it seems like Roger Goodell was kind of caught with his pants down in this situation, but we'll see. We got Deshaun Watson, another one of those Titans characters. Aaron Donald, one of, if not the best, defensive player in the game. Durham Smythe, rookie card. Carry on Johnson, introductions. Not looking so good for that gentleman. Speaking of which, Odell Beckham, Demarius Thomas. All right, so we should have memorabilia card or an autographed memorabilia card here. I am not at all holding my breath on that one. But we shall see. Put that in the back there. All right, we're going with Joe Mixon, who's a pretty nice young running back. Marshawn Lynch. Another Aaron Rodgers kid reporter. Oh, shit. Messed that up. Oh, and I got slightly above. Slightly above the Sam Darnold. We got Josh Rosen. Dual jersey. I believe he's down in Tampa Bay, which honestly is a pretty decent landing spot for him. Learn behind one of the best ever. Uh, top 10 pick to almost an afterthought the next year. That is pretty much unheard of. We'll see if he can turn his career around. I personally doubt it, but we shall see. That's just what happens sometimes when your franchise is looking for a quarterback. They get a little desperate. Their eyes get a little big. The dicks get a little hard, and you end up dra drafting Josh Rosen 10th overall. So, All right, guys. That was 2018 Absolute Memorabilia Blaster Box Retail. Come back at you with another video soon.